What's up, everybody? Justin here, bringing you another poorly reviewed beer from Highland Brewing Company, Asheville, North Carolina. This is Southern Sixer IPA. From the brewery, six American hop varieties bring assertive citrus and tropical fruit notes to this West Coast inspired IPA, along with hints of pine and green pepper. Golden in color and medium body, this brew finishes bitter and crisp with a lingering dank hop presence. Close to home, Southern Sixers refers to a group of Southern Appalachian Mountains over 6,000 feet in elevation. Uh, ABV is 6%, IBU 60, hops used are Equinox, Mosaic, Columbus, Cascade, Chinook, and Simcoe. All right. I would go ahead and say golden in color, as they uh, mentioned. Maybe a finger's worth of head, maybe a little bit under. As I hold up to the light, it uh, brightens up into more of a yellow highlighted beer. Of course, still golden, but yellow highlights. I can see some material swirling around in the in the glass, but um, just a few carbonation bubbles shooting up. Almost, almost none, in fact. Okay, let's try it. Mm. Wow, uh, lots of mango. Uh, lot, lots of man mango, a little bit of papaya. I'm um, certainly getting a lot more tropical fruit than um, than citrus, I would say. Uh, getting a little bit of funkiness or that dankness that's kind of in the back half of the drinking experience. Maybe just a little bit of a, a bright citrusy note. Not really, not really a, a you know any specific fruit flavor, but just kind of a, a little bit of a citrusy feel, a, a bright acidic feel to it. Um, like as I said, especially in the back half. Pine notes pretty muted. There's maybe a little bit of a, a grassy uh, thing in there too. A little bit of a floral note as well. I'd say the florals maybe a little bit more in the, well, no, it's there in the back half of the drinking experience. The back half is very much loaded. The front half is, is basically like, as I said, mango especially, maybe a, uh, a couple other tropical fruits as well but after that it really opens up to doing a lot of different things in the back half of the of the drinking experience yeah if you're gonna get any citrus any pine any of that pepper they're talking about and the funkiness that's all in that back half and it works pretty well too uh, it doesn't seem like a an overplayed mess it, it all kind of blend blends together pretty well the the front half with all the, the passion fruit uh, the, the yeah the passion fruits tropical fruits are not uh, super sweet there is some sweetness there but it's not um, not overpowering not cloying uh, and that really carries through most of the drinking experience but um that's a solid tropical IPA um, I don't think it's my favorite from um from Highland, I would say. I think the another of their seasonals, the Devil's Britches, I think I like more and I suppose a couple of a couple other things in their um, in their IPA profile, but uh, a solid beer. Not really bitter at all, not a lot of hot bitterness or anything like that. So um that's the what's it called? Southern Sixer IPA. And that's it for this edition of Poorly Reviewed Beer. You can find all of my reviews, video and written, along with news, commentary, and more at poorlyreviewedbeer.com. Also, check out PRB on Twitter and Facebook, Instagram, and Untapped. You can find all those links in the description below. If you're, if you're so inclined, like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around at Poorly Reviewed Beer.